Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Captain Orlando Muniz with Nomad Fishing Charters and today I'm fishing with my good friend Captain Sammy Arriaga aboard his 39 foot CV, the Blue Tails. Uh, Sammy's got a tournament team and we're going to be out doing some practice fishing for the upcoming season. Stay tuned. As we clear all of our inlet, it looks like we have calm seas and clear skies. Um, not exactly the best conditions for sail fishing. It will be challenging. Hopefully we can get a couple shots. Weekends and nice weather means lots and lots of boats on the fishing grounds. Our spread today is pretty standard for South Florida. We're going to be putting out a couple of kites and dangling three baits off each kite. The baits will be either, in this case we're using herring and we're using some blue runners. We do not have any goggle eyes which are especially good for this type of fish. Looks like we have a small fish on here. I don't think it's a target species. This will probably be released. After boating a couple of small kings and mice, we kept fishing and working looking for that sail bite. Up on the cliff, wrapped up on a fish. Maybe him. Both up. Okay, yeah, that's, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's the sail. That's the one you saw, buddy. Yes, sir. It's really important for everyone on the boat to work together. While one person fights a fish or a couple of fish, the others need to clear lines and maintain proper boat position so we can get a successful release. Once the fish settles down and the lines are cleared, it's time to start narrowing the gap between us and the fish to try to get a, a healthy release as quickly as possible. Fighting the fish from the bow allows us to move a little faster and close our, the distance to the fish and get the release a little quicker. Once someone grabs a leader, it's considered a release. In this case, because we're just fun fishing, we're going to bring the fish in a little closer and get yeah, some good pictures and video. You want him on the boat? Bring him up for a picture. 
on the side of the boat, not on, not on top of the boat. It's important to keep the fish in the water in order to ensure its survivability. This sailfish will be released unharmed and will likely be caught another day. That's crazy. This is what happens when you inhale helium. <laughs> it's not good. 